surgery today. Okay guys, don't worry about these scrubs. I'm just wearing them into the hospital and then I have to change into clean scrubs when I get there anyway before I go into surgery. But we don't have ice and I never have time in the morning to run and get nice coffee and you need a nice coffee like in New York. So what I did was I got a cup, I got a can of like espresso from the corner shop I put water in the cup and put it in the freezer and I was like, that's really clever. I'll have like an iced coffee in the morning. I'll just pour it into the cup and we're good to go. Look at how rank this looks. Actually, oh my God. I just caught it on camera floating to the top. Anyway, the, the big chunk of ice that's there was at the bottom. Okay, doesn't look too bad then. I'll see you on, on the way to stop right now. And I forgot my silver card. Oh fuck's sake. Okay, great. Thank you. Okay, See you later. Bye. Finished. Four hours. Recorrecting is fine. Coolest thing. So busy. Four surgeons, full time. It was insane. That was the, like literally the coolest thing I've ever done. It was bad. It was like a recorrection of a different person's work. And it was crazy. I'm busy the whole time for four full hours. And if you can't tell by the way I'm dressed, it's clinic day today. Guess what we start doing? We bought ice, we bought cups, we bought cold brew. I'm making my own iced coffee because it's too expensive to buy it. Okay, we're done today it was clinic all day so a lot of people with arthritis and in the spine which is hard to see spinal stenosis but yeah, today was good fun i love lennox hill i don't ever want to leave so i'm finished with um dr schwab today like literally one of the most amazing doctors and surgeons i've ever seen and tomorrow I'm going into the hand surgeon in a wire with them all day. So that should be fun, but I'm going to miss the spine for sure. You know when I said yes or last week, I thought the spine was too involved for me. I've changed my mind completely. And I don't know if that's whether because I like the spine per se or whether I just like love the surgeon and the team. Who knows? Whoa. So I'm gonna miss the spine. I'm gonna miss it! Jesus Christ. Anyway, that's it for today. Signing out, I'm going to Lucy's, my cousin's later, for dinner. She's in Colombia, so 
I've been a Columbia student, just living on the Upper East Side. It's very fancy. And now, I'm just gonna go home and get to meet her. And then they walk right in. I'm on my way in today, we're doing hand surgery. As I like to say, very exciting. So it's like 8am now, I should be there for quarter past eight, and yeah, it should be a good day. I'll let you know how it goes. Mm -hmm. Spines, so maybe I'm just a hypocrite and I need to spend a lot of time with each body part before I start to like it. Where are we going? Cinema. We're going to cinema to see what's the movie called? Secret. I've made a grave error in that I actually thought it was going to be hotter than it is, so my hair did not dry fully. Now I've got wet hair in cinema. Look at our popcorn. We're seeing vengeance. Cinema was so tiny and Stephen sat at the front. Safe to say the view was not great for the Good morning. I'm heading in clinic today. Hence my boring, boring outfit and my work crocs. Woo! Um, I'm with a different doctor. We're doing, I think, knees. So like sports with ACL tears, etc. And guess what? It is raining for the first time in two weeks. Look at this. And it's not baking hot, so I actually got a jumper with me today. Who knows? I'll let you know two days later. injections um, and then yeah I just learned a lot about the x-rays the anatomy of the knee which I could never get in my head um, but now I think I know it pretty well what else oh I met someone today called Annabella that's the first time ever to tweet someone with my name because it's unusual you know it's never on keychains but yeah it was a great day I really liked it I really like the knees. And also, yes, I'm taking the stairs up to floor 11 because it's quicker than waiting for the lift, the elevator. So yeah, I'm gonna collect my stuff, then I'm out of here. Welcome to my crib. <laughs> no, can we add a <laughs> Morning, guys. Today is research day, which I love because the research they're doing in Lennox Hill is so freaking cool. Like, the stuff that I'm learning, I'm like, I feel like this is like insider information that'll be in like textbooks, I don't know, in like five years time. It's just so freaking cool. I love it. I love being on the inside, you know? Any type of secret club, I want in. So this research is like a secret club that like, they're finding out new things about the spine and the bones. And I love it! So, um... That's the plan for today. I've got my iced coffee. I was going to say, remember when I was complaining about the heat? I regret complaining because now it's kind of cold and I have no jumpers. So it's actually, it's not cold. Like I'm still wearing like a sleeveless top, but it's getting a bit chilly. Probably like 20 degrees now instead of like the 30 that it normally is. So I do regret complaining about the heat. Although this is better for my skin and for not burning purposes. Yeah. So I'll talk to you later. Cheers. Done research. Well, I finished my day shopping the research but I love research. I learned some really cool things. Okay, here's an example. Um, so it's mainly spinal stuff. 
you know like you learn in school or maybe you don't know that your spine is like an s shape so you have like a convex and a concave spine so the first part of your spine your cervical spine which goes from your skull to kind of your shoulders i'd say about that space they in all the textbooks all i've ever learned is that it's um lordosis which kind of means that it's concave so when you're doing spinal surgery with people who have like you're recorrecting their spine say everyone always says oh we're going to correct the cervical spine back to the concave shape that's the goal well i just learned that in like an asymptomatic population so like people that don't have any pain neck pain 30 percent of them have a natural kyphosis you have a natural kyphosis which doesn't cause them any pain whatsoever so 30 percent of the population have a naturally occurring convex top part of their spine which is crazy because we just never learned about that we just learned like point blank period your spine goes in this shape but some people have a different spinal shape and like that's not accounted for when you do the surgery it's um you, they always say that they want to correct them back to this shape but if naturally they're this shape correcting them back to this shape is going to give them like severe muscle pain like your muscles are going to want to bring you back to the normal shape it might like overcorrect your head so you might not be able to look horizontal like there's a lot of factors that you have to take into consideration when doing spine surgery that you just like a lot of people don't because i guess some people don't stay up to date with the research and that could really help in like the patient population it help people have like a spine that's tailored to them instead of just the standard we're going to correct you to this shape when really maybe the best thing for you is to bring you back to this shape so it's just interesting to see all the new stuff that um the new research that's coming out and i love it and hopefully i'll be able to do some stuff remotely so yeah that's it for today i'm going to meet my mum and my sister they're coming in and we're going to go to the west light the rooftop bar tonight and tomorrow we're going to go to a show see you later bye arrived safely. They've eaten about 4,000 calories. <laughs> and deep fried Oreos. It's delicious. And we're going to see Beetlejuice tonight. I'm, I'm static. I'm static, bro. Okay, Alex doesn't know how to talk on no, camera. I'm getting a bit nervous now. <laughs> okay, thank you everyone for watching. I'm spending the weekend with... Hello. Hello. And that is it for today. I will see you next week. Bye. Oh, look at this. Wow. Thank <laughs> you.